Today, we thought of doing an adventure mm -hmm. from where we are staying, which is in PJ or Bikaling Jaya, to... We're going way out. We're not going to tell you exactly where yet, but it's about a two hour ride. We're not taking a long rail. We're taking the LRT and MRT to the last stop or one of the last stops. Yeah, it's a special place for it. It's one of the best places in the whole country to eat this dish. Ooh, I'm so excited. Yeah, me but too. Actually, since it's gonna be like two hours journey, we are heading to get our first meal of the day. Today is a pleasant day. I'm so glad it's not, so it's overcast, I would say. It's yeah. cloudy, but according to weather station, there is no rain in sight. Fingers hopefully. crossed. Fingers crossed. Um, but it's, a, it's not a sunny day, it's a lovely day, it's an overcast day, but lovely day, and it's... Nice breeze. Okay. Let's go eat. Let's go keep walking. So lunch is done. And here's Greg with his coffee. Yeah, trying to perk up with this uh, Vietnamese coffee. Highly recommend it. It's got a black, no sugar, very tasty. All right, let's head to our train station. It will take us to our transfer point and then from there we're gonna take the MRT. destination <laughs> this adventure and then we're gonna do some more and then you'll see come we made it there's literally a signage or a signpost that says Pinto A to Medan Sate Kajang came from right there, station, and we have to just go right here. Spot looks closed, but the light is on for the sign. Let's see. So three years ago, we were here before with our friends. Now we're back here again. Now it's different. Well, gonna experience this differently because it's just the two of us but we remember what we did what we had and hopefully they still have what we had and we're gonna get more something maybe I'm not sure but I don't know this one behind the camera wants to try something else for me I don't know maybe I'll stick with the basic it's so empty when we were here it was just packed and it was during lockdown, quote unquote. So that's Craig trying to figure out what to eat, and I'm just here looking at the durian belanda sarsu. We gotta get it. <laughs> we gotta get the durian balanda. Oh, I haven't had it in so long. It's so good. <laughs> All right, ready to order? The rice. It's, it's more sticky this time. <laughs> <laughs> we have our nasi impit compressed rice. With cucumbers, onions, mm -hmm. peanut sauce, 
much more like liquidy versus oily, which I like, and chili paste. I love that. So you can actually customize how spicy you want it. It's pretty awesome. Yes. So we're just waiting for our satay, and once that gets here, it's time to crumble. Chicken. Two of these are supposed to be deer. Two are supposed to be duck. That is well marinated chicken. It's perfect with that peanut sauce. Add that chili paste in there for that kick. Oh, maybe the best peanut sauce out of any satay we've had here in Malaysia, I would say. Mm. Oh, which is this? This is definitely deer meat because you can get that chew. It's very lean. But it's not bland. It's, I really like the chew of it actually. It's well marinated, it's juicy, and really get those flavors of that lemongrass in there too. Also very delicious. I would, I would highly recommend trying the beer for something exotic, but not too crazy. Totally different kind of texture compared to goat or beef. The duck's kind of fatty. Mm. Duck is quite good too. Ooh, that satay was so good, so delicious. Just hit the spot. Wow. Um, yeah. Something about the satay kajang is really why they call it satay kajang. It's, it's that good. Yep. So this place looks so empty now. We're here on a weekday afternoon, but we were here before. It was nighttime, and this place was popping. We just love how close it is to the MRT. So if you want to come out to Kajang, it's very easy. But we highly recommend coming here because it's just steps away from the MRT. No extra travel needed. Awesome. Which it's good thing or a bad thing, you need to walk all that. <laughs> <laughs> Worthwhile though. Love these uh, old shop houses in Kakinima here. They're a perfect way to burn off all that sate and nasi and pit with this ate. Yes. A lot of character over here in the uh, city part here of Kajang. So this was also close to the train station. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> this is another one of the really famous ones called Sate Haji Samuri. Now we tried Willy Sate three years ago, which we loved. This is the other very famous one. We're gonna go give it a shot. Coconut cheers, kalapa cheers. All right, our sate is here. We have four chicken, one kambing, and one arnab rabbit. All right, we're gonna go rabbit. really tasty. Very smoky this one. I like it a lot. It's very lemongrassy. You see all the strands? Lemongrass, absolutely delicious. Very peanutty too, not so oily. Also really nice. This, I'm, I'm very happy with this sundae. It's really good. Wow, oh, smoky. Yeah. Wow. Very lemongrassy. Yes. And the meat is so soft. Yeah. It almost like minced chicken. It's very smoky. Mm. I'm impressed. You almost don't even need the sauce on this one. Wow. Haji Samori is a small chain here in the Klang Valley area. It's the original location here at Kajang. I love the building. This, the wooden building has got real kampung kind of vibes, the details. They even have like a little like glass case enclosed with like um, sate and like the grill, everything. Cool spot. I highly recommend trying this one too. What a beautiful, adventurous feeling. Uh, day has been here in Kajang. We enjoyed the day so much. Yep. We ate a lot of satay. We walked a little bit and now we're gonna head back to our train at the train station of mm -hmm. course. 
Yeah, Kajan really surprises as far as the buildings and the old shop house. Did not know that was even here. Glad we looked around. Perfect way to burn off those calories and hope you guys enjoyed this one. One, this is a perfect trip from KL, outside of KL. And if you want to go a little bit more food traveling or food adventure, then you can definitely try one of the places or two of those places or everything or <laughs> all of both places that we've been to. They're both delicious in their own way. Let us know if you ever want to take a trip down here. It's so close to KL. The ride is so pleasant and it cost us it as was, of 2023. Uh... 13 ringgit 20 cents for two of us each way so a total last like 26 ringgit 40 cents round trip for two people which is great we didn't want to imagine what it'll be on grab yes and taking the train no traffic mm -hmm. that's right i'm looking at all these cars right here right now <laughs> traffic is here okay let's go it's rush hour head back to our train station get on the train Mm-hmm.